changes they might need to make at the hide. Good. Sounds like my solicitor's starting to get through to her. Hmm. I'll see if I can find out more from Gabby over dinner. No, don't push it too hard. He's supposed to be a nanny, not a legal expert. We don't want him getting suspicious. I can handle Gabby. I thought we were in this together. I could do a lot more. I see Kim every day. I could help persuade her. No, no, I'm dealing with Kim. Your job's Gabby. We both want to get this sorted as soon as possible. Gabby's got to come home early, so maybe we can meet later and you can get me up to date with what you've been doing. Makes sense for us to compare notes. So what time should we meet? No, no, I can't do tonight. Something's come up. I'll talk to you later. Wow, you look great. Leaving you behind can do that for a girl. Yeah, all right. I admit it. I made a mistake. I'm sorry. There you are. Now you can see what you're missing. Oh, no, please don't walk away. Well, why not? It's the least you deserve after the way you treated me. I've said that, I'm sorry. And they're just words. All right, so it needs a bit of action. How about we discuss it over a good dinner? <laughs> OK, you tell me what I need to do to persuade you. Well, then, do you know what? Yeah, you can start with dinner. Yeah? But if you haven't persuaded me to forgive you by the time we get to pudding, then I'm going to embarrass you in front of that whole restaurant just like you embarrassed me in the wool pack. Seriously? Seriously. Question is, are you willing to take that risk? I love a good challenge. 